generally from the media you hear that they're a bit dodgy. That it's got a higher crime rate, that there's a lot of youth trouble around there. From the responses that we received, it was obvious that many do hold the area in a negative light. One of occupational therapy, including several edited books and a whole slew of papers, and she's won a lot of awards and traveled to give keynote addresses in 13 countries. And in 2011, she received an Australian Affinity Award. Yeah, let's give them a. <laughs> Being a marine biologist, I am passionate about the environment. It's really important to regenerate yourself by actually going into nature. At the end of a stressful day or a stressful week, uh, it just makes all the difference if you can actually find a beautiful natural space um, to, to rest and recuperate. And for the rest, well, legislation is shooting down those pathetic stragglers. <laughs> No, I just cannot fathom how people can be so selfish and so ignorant. He's the server. Yeah, yeah, um, it's Italian. Italian! Yeah. You've walked right into heavy hell, mother. You know, hip hop to me was was an outlet. It was probably the only option I would take to um, put myself out there as a personality in society, like somebody who does hip hop. I have opened for a couple of names. I've sort of gotten used to what you've got to go through when you get into the venue. But Exhibit was different 